Times are changing and not all African American students want to go to historically black colleges, universities. Jillian Townsend is a first year marketing major and hopes to see more minorities in her classroom. I just want to see more minorities in my classrooms. Like I want to look around and see a rainbow of different like minorities and different like identifying people. Colleges are gradually beginning to incorporate more diversity into their demographics and curriculum. Jonas Spencer is a senior journalism student and president of Ebony. We're finally starting to be heard and felt on campus, but it's like, it's a baby step. Creative writing professor Jabari Asim thinks Emerson could do a lot more with raising their African American student population. Uh, I think our numbers are pathetic. Uh, I'd really like to see many, many more African American students. I think Emerson can definitely do more to make African American students feel more welcome. I think that's what a lot of schools are trying to do right now to be more inclusive because the times are changing. Students don't, all African American students don't just want to go to HBC. Organizations such as Ebony, Flawless Brow, and Power create a space for African Americans to feel welcome. So far, Emerson hasn't acknowledged Black History Month, but other orgs such as Ebony have created events for Black History Month. Most of the programming that I saw during Black History Month um, during my time here at Emerson has mostly been events through the cultural center. No, I don't think my culture is celebrated at Emerson because aside from Ebony, which is my org, what else has the school done in the whole? Maybe it's put on like one event, but aside from that, it's done nothing. Like, have they done anything in the dining hall? Have they done anything for students? Have they done anything for professors? Honestly, for black people in America, we were never supposed to be free to begin with. So that's one thing, first and foremost, so that's a celebration of that. I tend to think of Black History Month as for everyone who isn't black because I live black history life 365 days a year.